Hello. My name is Shahzan Zari. I'm a member of technical staff at the Open Networking Foundation. And today I'll be speaking to you about the ORAM E2AP uh, interface implementation uh, that we have done in OAI as part of the SDRAM project. So uh, you're probably aware that uh, ORAM has uh, defined uh, E2 interface um, between uh, between a RAN node uh, such as EMB or GNB and um, the and the controller, uh, which is the NRT rig. Um, this E2 interface uh, is meant to enable SDN control uh, of the RAN nodes. <clears throat> and ONF, uh, as part of the SD-RAN project, uh, is developing a ORAN compliant um, uh, RIC um, that is microservices based and cloud native. And uh, it's, it's also developing uh, X apps uh, along with its partners uh, um, that uh, are hosted on the on the RIC uh, that implement the, the service specific functionality. Now, so so um, obviously we are a part we are working with our RAN vendor partners um, who have or are developing uh, um, E2 nodes, uh, ORAN compliant E2 nodes, uh, which, which also expose the E2 interface. But along with that, for our own reference implementation and for our own dev test and uh, CI purposes, we are leveraging OAI, uh, which, which we have uh, uh, augmented uh, with, uh, with, the E2, E2, with the E2 support. So, so our SDRAM solution um, consists of uh, of our RIC um, that hosts uh, that hosts uh, X apps, um, both by us and by our partners, and it interworks with uh, with with RAN nodes or or RAN compliant RAN nodes from from multiple vendors, but. Uh, it, we use OAI-based uh, 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 CUDU nodes, both uh, on real hardware and, and simulation um, for our own uh, internal uh, CI and dev test purposes. And we also have a, a simulator uh, that, uh, that only supports control plane um, and that we use for scale testing. So OAI uh, is, a, is a key component um, that, uh, that has helped us uh, in, in verifying um, and developing our RIC. So taking a closer look at um, at, at this uh, at this E2 functionality, um, it's a uh, it's a neat it's it's what we call an E2 agent um, that um, um, that's that's added to uh, that's that's implemented in OAI. Uh, it can be used uh, it can be used uh, with the with this with um, uh, we are, we are using it uh, we are using OAI in a split CU DU mode. So you see it over here uh, with the CUC, but it could also go with um, um uh with it with with the with the du and uh we're using oai along uh, in 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 our test bed uh and in our uh, our ci uh along with our um our core which which we call the omec uh and as you see over here we use uh oai uh both um both on uh, on the ran um and for the for the ue as well and we and we use and we're using um, uh, commercial UE uh, to test also. So taking a closer look at the E2AP and the uh, and E2 and ORAMs E2AP and E2SM. Um, E2AP is a, is a is a gen general protocol um, which um, uh, by which the the RIC uh, communicates with the disaggregated E2 nodes. And the E2SMs uh, essentially uh, extend the the E2AP protocol by adding services specific for functionality um, and you can view them essentially as contracts between um, the service specific um, X app um, and the E2 node uh, and they define uh, service specific, specific protocols uh, that are in, implemented on top of the E2AP specification. So the implementation of a given E2SM, uh, in fact, you know, um, for a, for a, for a, 
E2 node uh, to be ORAN compliant, it should support the E2AP protocol first, first of all. And then it it should support uh, the, the E2SMs, the required E2SMs, the service models. Uh, and um, so, so what uh, we have done is we have added the E2AP protocol support and uh, support for one of the service models that uh, that have that that has been standardized by 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 ORAN, which is the E2SM KPM. Um, KPM stands for Key Performance Metrics. Uh, so this is uh, this has been added uh, into OA, and this is um, what we have been using to test our our uh, our rig with. So taking a, a little uh, you know closer look uh, at at uh, at for example the 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 KPI. Mon, um, the KPI monitoring X app um, uh, on, on our uh, RIC platform uh, and how it uh, interacts with the E2 node via the RIC. So it would start with uh, an app uh, such as the KPI Mon app, um, sending a request to the RIC uh, 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 to subscribe to, um, to certain uh, performance metrics. Now, um, either before or later, um, E2 nodes would join, uh, would connect to the RIC um, uh, over SCTP over here, uh, or the E2, 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 E2 uh, using the E2AP protocol would uh, send a setup request uh, advertising their functionality, uh, advertising what they can support, what are the RAN functions that they support. Um, and the RIC acknowledges the E2 setup uh, request. And then um, it would, on behalf of the of the app of the X apps, uh, uh, send it the subs subscription request. Um, in this case, for asking for the uh, you know asking the E2 node to send it the key performance metrics. Um, and now, it, in in this request, it would specify what time period um, it you know uh, granularity of the time time period that it uh, it requires these uh, indications uh, of the key performance metrics from the from the E2 node. And the E2 node, um, uh, the E2 agent on the on the on the E2 node would uh, uh, would send a response uh, to the subscription request, and then start forwarding the the indications uh, with the key performance metrics uh, to the RIC, and the RIC then forwards it to the the X apps. So <coughs> this is uh, this is a view of how we are using OAI um, uh, in. Um, in our uh, setups, uh, we use it in, in in two ways. One is on real hardware, where um, uh, with 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 maybe one or two uh, UEs, real UEs, uh, either running uh, the UE um, uh, OAI uh, based UEs or commercial UEs. Um, so this would would uh, this would uh, you know on the left hand side you see what what uh, um, how, how uh, you know how, how you you're integrating. Um, OAI with uh, our RIC. Um, more interesting is we, we are using OAI uh, in our um, in 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 in, um, in a software test uh, as part of our, our dev test or, or, or as part of a CI pipeline, um, where it's um, where uh, the OAI uh, with the E2 agent is part of our um, uh, what, what's called as SD RAN in a box, uh, which you can spin up on a laptop or or, or as part of a CI job. Uh, yeah, so this is uh, just uh, just a hardware setup that uh, early early setup uh, on our desk that um, when we were trying out OAI. Uh, since then, it's been moved into our labs, and this gives you a view of, of our um, SD RAM in a box uh, version uh, with with the OAI code. As you see here, it, it, yeah, it consists. Of, we, this this all spins up as as containers, um, and, you know, and and, and it. it it's, it consists of the apps, the RIC, um, the OAI, um, OAI CU, DU, and the UE, uh, along with a core, uh, the, 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 the OMEC control plane and the, and the UPF. Uh, and and, the, and, and, and so we use this to, to test end-to-end -end, uh, data plane as well, which we cannot with our uh, ransom uh, software. So I'd like to uh, end this. Um, so, so it's, it's as I said, it's OAI has been uh, is very useful to us uh, in in, um, in in our um, um, in, in 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 our testing of uh, of a RIC platform, and we 
intend to uh, continue to support this. Uh, more importantly, we, we would like to upstream this. I would like to con con contribute this to, uh, to OEI um, and help uh, upstream it. We'd like to see it upstream and we intend to keep maintaining it uh, by adding, um, adding new service models, both um, if there's interest are uh, our proprietary service models that we are developing along with the partners uh, or the standard uh, service models that uh, ORAN is working on. Uh, and uh, um, as I said, the, the, the service models that we are working on um, are, uh, are with, with these partners over here with Facebook uh, specifically on, on the on the on the RAN hardware side, we are working with uh, with the, with our partners such as Radisys, and uh, um, we are also looking at as as part of the of our uh, SDRAN solution, we are also looking at uh, at slicing, for example, uh, and the support of slicing in OAI, and how we can leverage that or enhance that um, to uh, to integrate that with uh, the slicing support in our. So I hope this was useful, and I hope uh, that um, this uh, that this is the beginning of uh, a fruitful partnership uh, between ONF and uh, and the OAI developer community. And I look forward to the collaboration. Thank you so much.